Hi, I'm Nicola. Hi, I'm Hugh. And we're from the My Korean Husband blog, and you're watching the AU Review. Do you actually get opportunities to actually visit the big cities uh, much, or especially Seoul? Do you actually do you go to Seoul a lot? We go, it depends, like, mm. sometimes it's just once a month, sometimes it's a few times in yeah, a month. Yeah, a few times a month. Like, this month we went to Seoul, like, three times. Yeah. So it really depends month yeah. to month. When and we have the meeting meetings with, with the publishing, the publishing company. company. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we go and see some other bloggers sometimes. So Yeah. yeah. Talk about other bloggers. Who yes. have you actually connected up with here in uh, Korea? We're good friends with Simon Martino from Meet Your Kimchi, actually. Yeah. They let us stay in their apartment sometimes, which is <laughs> really nice. Yeah, it's, they're nice. It's really funny because even though Hugh is Korean, he is a country boy, so he's not used to Seoul at all. And they sort of take us around and be like, oh, this is a good place. And they know way more than we do. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm country pumpkin. So <laughs> I don't know anything about city. It's okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hugh, question for you. Now, now you're back home. Has it been difficult at all to actually come back to Korea and just settle into the Korean life again? Not nearly. It's easy because I live with my parents. <laughs> so there's nothing nearly hard. What about when you first came back? I remember we did a video um, when we first came yeah, back. Yeah, I think there when I things. just came back, I just can't nearly... I don't know. I, I couldn't nearly do anything like in the beginning, right? I can't remember. <laughs> it's too long ago. <laughs> yeah, it's too too long ago. And I, I didn't remember that Korea was that cold because we mm. came back in winter. Mm. It was super cold. And I, I was wearing only T-shirts, right? Yeah. From the airport. It was yeah. like... Um, minus five. Minus five. Because <laughs> you're <was> mad. <laughs> yeah. I was mad. But <laughs> yeah. I yeah. think you also had a few problems fitting back into the Korean hierarchy. Yes, and hierarchy. Elders. Hierarchy system. Yeah. Yeah. But it's fine now. Yeah, it's fine now, but sometimes I can't mm. really agree with all the people. I mean, like, sometimes they say, all the people are saying is always right, but I can't really can't agree, agree with really. that. <laughs> yeah. Nicola, questions for you. How have you settled into uh, South Korea? Um, pretty well, I think, but I think my experience is very different to a lot of other people. A lot of other mm. people come in and they're working or they're working as a teacher or they're a student and they're in the cities. Um, for me, I've come into a family and in a lot of ways it's been like a second childhood because I don't understand, even though I'm learning Korean, I don't understand mm. everything that's going on. I don't understand what the adults are saying. Um, I sort of, you know, do my work. We, we work in the studio and I do my comic and we do our video and we do that. And then I ride my bike around and come home when the street lights come on. It's, it's sort of been, it's been like a second childhood like that. You know, even though I'm, I'm 30, oh, I'm 31 soon. That's pretty scary. It's been just sort of really really refreshing um and it's been really really cool and i think being in the countryside makes that so different but i feel like i'm about to start my teen years now where it's going to be hard and i'm expected to be able to speak korean you know at a much higher level and all these things like you that will, you will eventually. <laughs> because you are trying really hard uh, it's very yeah. difficult she's like princess <laughs> yeah like the way you say princess though it sounds like i'm spoiled but it's just that your parents care so much and they want to do they love everything you. everything for me so i am i'm treated like a like a little a little girl yeah. um, so it has been it has been quite nice like that to be yeah. spoiled and pampered like that <laughs> lucky you <laughs> and what about your friends have you ever been have you caught up with friends as well that um yeah you I've, seen for a while? yeah i've met so many of my friends here but they are all working their part and they have families now so i don't know it's hard to see them often mm -mm. so i just see them that just like once a month mm. yeah You've made a lot of new friends. Since yeah, I made back. new friends. Yeah, yeah, because what you're doing now is very different, different um, from other people. The, the people that you went to school with and yeah. that. So you've made some new connections with people that have had a few more experiences yes. like you. Yeah.